I'm here with Claude. We're at VaynerMedia HQ in New York, and we have just had such a profound, such a powerful discussion, and just a real discussion yeah. about about people, um, about what Claude does for people, for humans, for VaynerMedia. And I thought it would be incredible to share her story and get her to tell you a little bit more about what she does. Thank you. Thanks, James. <laughs> Um, hi, I'm Claude Silver. I am the Chief Heart Officer at VaynerMedia. Um, I work with Gary Vaynerchuk, who's amazing. <laughs> and I take care of 750 people every single day. And uh, I don't do it personally. I scale myself so other people can help me take care of them too. Yeah, absolutely. So when you have to deal with so many people and so many people rely on you for positivity, rely on you for motivation, rely on you for inspiration, how do you go about that? So do you want to unpack a little bit more about scaling Claude? Yeah, sure. Well, first and foremost, it's an honor to even be able to hold space for people and touch people. And, and so I, I definitely come from a place of gratitude every single day. Um, to be able to be in the presence of someone when they are growing or unlocking themselves is the greatest gift that I certainly have in my day. Uh, creating a, a place here where people feel uh, both physically and psychologically safe to bring their best selves to work is first and foremost my biggest priority. Okay. I spend a lot of time listening to people, um, trying to unpack them, uh, help them remove roadblocks in their lives and uh, help them further grow and develop themselves. And the most amazing thing that's happening here is we end up teaching people life skills. Yeah. You know, self-awareness, empathy, accountability, you know, purpose that's that's just more than client service yeah um, and so as I'm spending time with people and I'm listening to them and then and then really taking action on what what it is they need help with we're I'm scaling myself because then they go back to their desk and they feel like oh my god something happened or I moved from point A to point C and they then go back to their desk or their their uh, their pods with a sense of positivity and a sense of can do and a sense of I am. They're being at, they're actively um, moving the ball forward, and so that scales me in a big way. Yeah, you're you know? creating your own tribe, you're creating your own community yeah. to literally do what you're doing. Yeah, 750 plus people, you know, um, and it starts from the top. I mean, it starts from Gary. Uh, without a doubt, you know, really dedicating this place as a people-first organization um, and having heart and humility first and foremost. And then, you know, my job is to really make sure that the, the, the ground, the soil, where all the people are, um, is getting the nutrients and, um, and really, really uh, getting fed every single day, you know. That's fantastic. Claude talks in um, really vivid metaphors and analogies. No, no, in the best possible way because it grounds it. I right? do. You can visualize it. You can see it. And you're yeah. right. You you <laughs> you nourish the soil, right? And that's that's where the seeds grow, yeah. right? To to take that analogy further. Awesome. So, the last question I love asking everybody because it really really encapsulates the type of journey you've been on and the experiences you've had is if you could talk to Claude when you first started your journey whether it was with Vayner or whether it was all the way back when you started your professional journey as well. Everything you've learned about people, everything you've learned about yourself, what would you just say to yourself in terms of advice? Cast away any kind of shame. Like, do not carry shame with you. It has been sludge in my life, and it was unnecessary. So I would say, you know, just believe in yourself. How do you go about shutting out the the shame i guess like with social conditioning and with all this pressure it's like that potentially could be really hard like yeah. how did you go about doing that a lot of work yeah. <laughs> <laughs> some therapy uh, yeah. a lot of like solo introspection and being around really really uh, incredible people that were in tune with their heart um forgiveness is a massive part of that so mm. acceptance and forgiveness and acceptance of of who I am and all of me and all of you know some of the mistakes I've made and forgiveness for the fact that uh, I held on to that for so long because that stuff's just like it's just a burden you know yeah. it's just a burden and and you know my place is of the light and uh, and so is yours I love so that. let's shine I love that yeah. okay if anybody wants to check you out learn a little bit more about you or anything mm -hmm. for VaynerMedia anything you want to tell yeah well find me on Twitter Claude Silver uh, or Instagram, Claude Silver. <laughs> uh, VaynerMedia, it's uh, VaynerMedia.com, and uh, I'd love to hear from you. 
Awesome. That is Claude Silva, Chief Heart Officer and incredible, incredible person. Such a privilege for me. Thank you so much for coming on. Thank you so much. It's been awesome. Peace. Awesome.